Weezies, happy Tuesday. It is 7.40 right now and AJ went to go take Vanessa to school. She goes to school every Tuesday and Thursday, well, in person. And then the rest of the week is just at home. So yeah, she went to school today. And I am boiling some eggs. I have some eggs going. And I'm also going to warm up some bacon, cook some bacon. I cook it in the microwave, that's why I said warm up. So I have it ready to go. I just put it on paper towel like that, and then I'll warm it up for two minutes. I'll do a minute for every slice. So I have two slices, so two minutes. And it just makes it really easy. I'm gonna make my coffee. Okay. I'm gonna use this mug today. I'm sure you guys are tired of seeing the same three mugs, <laughs> but I only have three mugs for now. Anyways. Okay, so on Sunday when I went grocery shopping, I picked up the Nut Pods creamer. At Winco, they only had just this one, just the one kind. I know there's different ones, but Winco only had this one. I want to go to another store, maybe Sprouts. I'm sure Sprouts probably has more flavors or like more options. Um, but this one is the almond plus coconut creamer in French vanilla, and it's unsweetened and dairy-free. It's this. Um, every tablespoon has only 10 calories. It has zero carbs, zero sugar. It's plant-based, non-GMO, soy-free, carrageenan-free, keto-friendly, and paleo-friendly. And only has a few ingredients, actually. So... I wanted to try this because, you know, the other creamers have a lot of chemicals in them, so I wanted to try this, and I tried it yesterday, and I like it. It's really good. Um, it kind of just tastes kind of like almond milk, and you don't taste the coconut at all, because I don't like coconut. Okay, I do like coconut, but I'm really weird with my coconut. I'm, like, really picky. Um, yeah, I'm just really picky when it comes to coconut, so I wasn't sure if you would be able to taste the coconut in here and you, you can't, you don't taste any coconut. So it's really good, I like it. It's not as creamy as a regular creamer or like heavy whipping cream. It's more like an almond milk consistency. And I put, I started yesterday with two tablespoons and it wasn't really enough so I actually used three tablespoons. And the color even looks like almond milk. And then I put the sweetener. I'll do like half a tablespoon of the sugar-free vanilla. So I'll just put like, you know, whoop, half of that. And then I also have caramel. This one is the skinny syrup brand of the caramel. What the heck? So we'll just do like half of that. really good let me know if you guys have tried this creamer before do you like it just you know what are your thoughts on this nut pods I think they sell this at Costco I have never seen it at my Costco but probably because I wasn't really looking for it but I've seen it on like Instagram accounts and they have these at Costco but at first I was complaining because I was like this thing is so small I'm gonna go through this so quickly, but I guess it's okay because it says you should drink this within seven to 10 days. So I feel like this is the perfect amount for one week. Makes sense. Actually, you know what? The other creamers like the Coffee Mate and the International Delight, I think are the same way. Like once you open it, you're supposed to consume it within a certain number of days. And I'm pretty sure I don't do that. Like I'm pretty sure it sits in my fridge longer than it should, but like, I never had a problem. I never had any issues. So, I don't know. Oh my gosh, you guys. I have an update on the house. Yesterday, the flooring company called me and they said they have a tentative start date of May 17th. So, they said as long as all of the supplies come in, then they will start on May 17th. 
So I'm gonna drive down. I'm gonna drive the Camry actually. I'm gonna drive down on Saturday, May 15th with the Camry. I'm gonna fill it up with as much stuff as I can. And then I will stay until the 17th, which is the day that they start. I'm gonna leave them with the key. That way they can just let themselves in every day. And I'm gonna fly home. So I'm gonna leave the Camry there and then I'm just gonna fly home on Monday. And then she said it would take probably the whole week. She said actually carpet only takes one day and then the laminate will take like the whole week. And it's two different crews doing it. Like one crew for carpet, one crew for laminate. Um, and yeah, the whole week it will take. So I'm probably just gonna fly back down on Friday just to, you know, on the last day. Hopefully, see, I'm not sure if they're really gonna be done on Friday, but basically I'm gonna go down on the last day when they're, when they're done. Um, and I know I said like I was gonna drive again, but I don't wanna do it anymore. <laughs> Cause I'm gonna drive down on that weekend and then we're already gonna, we're already moving like the next weekend. So, and then I have to drive again. So like, I think three trips is good enough for the drive, you know? So yeah, you guys, I'm so excited. I can't wait to see, I can't wait to see how it will look with the new flooring. It's gonna look so different. It's gonna look like a completely different house. Even with just the paint, it already looks so different. Like it looks so fresh and bright. I love it. Oh yeah, I got pictures. Um, my painter, Renee, he sent me pictures of the house all done so I'll maybe I'll put some pictures up here I did post some on my Instagram but these ones are like completely completely done because the ones I posted it wasn't really done yet so maybe I'll post some pictures here and then Vanessa's room looks so cute you guys one of her walls because she did an accent wall it's sage oh my gosh you guys it's so cute it's gonna look so cute with her white furniture with the gray floors um, just with all her accessories and stuff it's gonna be so cute Okay guys, so I'm gonna go to work. Well, I'm gonna eat my breakfast and then go to work. I hope everyone has a good Tuesday. Don't forget, stay positive and be productive. Get it. Our friend Liana is so sweet. <laughs> she sent us an edible arrangements and she said, congratulations on your new home and belated happy birthday, Vanessa. Sorry, I missed the party. Miss and love you guys, Liana. She sent these chocolate covered fruits. Oh yeah, my god! strawberry, banana, and apple. Bye. Uh, it's five o'clock. I just got off of work. Well, I got off at 4 30. And the three of us, we're gonna get our COVID vaccine. It's our first shot. And we're at CVS. I don't think I mentioned that. Maybe I did. I don't remember. But yeah, we're at CVS. And we're getting the Pfizer. Because I think it's the, they told me it's the only one that she can get. From 16. She's 16. We just got our first dose of the COVID vaccine. How do you guys feel? I feel like I can fly. <laughs> what the heck? It's literally been like three yeah. minutes, you guys. I went last, so I just got mine. And we're all doing the arm swing, arm rotation. Yeah, Hopefully our arms won't yeah. hurt later, you know? Yep. This is what we saw on TikTok. Yep. You gotta do this so your arm won't get sore. Yep. And then we already have our appointment for our second dose. It's gonna be on May 17th. Yep, same place. Same time, actually. I have never seen this before. Have you guys tried this before? Snickers peanut brownie squares. This sounds really good. Snickers is actually my favorite uh, chocolate bar. We're outside playing with Jeff and he now he really likes that toy. That's like his favorite one, right? right? He doesn't like the other toys. Oh, he got distracted. You guys, he gets distracted so easily. Jeff. That's the shake off his stuff. I know. Don't touch him. Jeff. He's eating grass. Oh, he's eating the grass. And he still doesn't like the scratcher. Come on. Play with the ball. I 
can't <laughs> hit it. No? Oh. Okay. Oh my. Yeah, get into it. Well, he should be here any minute. Excuse, excuse me? Hello? Uh, are you Steuben? That is me. I'm Steuben. Oh, uh, it's nice to meet you. Uh, you nice must be my new... Steve. Nice to meet you. You must be my new ending partner. Just just come down here. This oh. is where we, where we do it, actually. Down. Yes, there we go. More down? Okay. Yeah, that, that, that's fine. So, my name's Steuben. Nice to meet you. Yes, this is Steuben. Uh, he's my Hi, new... Hi, my name's Steuben. He's my new ending partner because yesterday Vanessa and I... Uh, she quit, basically. She's no good. So, this is Steuben. I'm Steuben. He's gonna be much better than Vanessa. Right, right, Steuben? That is me, Steuben. Great. Uh, I just got the, the vaccine. Mm. So I might be a little different this mm. this ending. So just get used to it. Just we'll get through it. Steuben vaccine. Good. Yep. Did, did you get one too? Steuben vaccine. Steuben got a vaccine as well. Uh, anyways, uh, so uh, tell tell the vlog a little bit about yourself. My name's Steuben. Um, I'm here. My name is Steuben. Steuben vaccine. Great! I'm sure that the people will love you. Mm. Um, there's a something over there. Can, can you get it? It's, it's a prop for the ending. Mm. Steuben, be back. And then come back out as Vanessa. You called? No, I didn't call you. Oh. What are you doing here? I'm filming my ending with Steuben. Where is he? He's getting a prop for me. Um, Unlike some people. Whatever. I don't need you. Steuben back. Well, we've just run out of time, so why don't I just say good night, and you can say triple whammy. Triple whammy. With Steuben. With Steuben. Okay. Triple whammy. Triple whammy. Bye, bye. Baby.